Uh, we got a, a hint from one of the contact tracers, which is one of the people who's been contacted, um, contracted actually to do the contact tracing. And what she says is that there's a man who, um, you know, as part of contact tracing, they had to go and take um, his sample for test. And this was taken on the 2nd of April. Now, eight days later, it was discovered that this man was positive for coronavirus. He lives in a family, uh, in a house with his family members, mm -hmm. and we're talking a large family. Now, this man has started showing symptoms of the virus. It's been three days now since the test results came out that he tested positive. And the issue has been escalated to the national level to let them understand that there's a man in this particular area who's tested positive. Unfortunately, three days after the test results, he still remains at home with his family. They share a bathroom, they share a toilet, um, and you know, they're very interactive in the home. We're hearing that one other family member has started showing symptoms. So this man is coughing, and the other family member has started um, showing signs of headache and diarrhea. And so we're calling on the national um, authorities to do something about it as soon as possible. Please find out. But we also want to understand why Three days after we discovered that he's tested positive, nobody is doing anything about it. Now, this same person is also complaining about the lack of PPEs. So some of them, um, you know, if they are four in a number, only one person gets the overall cover up. And even that, they don't have boots. So they have the disposable gown, the gloves and the face mask, but no, uh, no boots. But only one person wears it, and the other four, unfortunately, because there's not enough PPEs, the others have to go along without, um, you know, any, any protection at all. And this is also dangerous. And so, please, authorities, we need to do something about this as soon as possible. And so this is the update on the particular man, and we hope that as soon as possible they can pick him up because he's been calling, asking why he's not been picked up, especially because now it looks like they are pa he's passing on the virus to the other members in his household as well.